So have you ever been in a situation where somebody's giving you instructions, where to go, how to do it, and you finally get there and you're going to use the instructions and you start to doubt what they said. And you start having feelings like maybe this isn't what they said to do. Maybe this is wrong. And you kind of jeopardize the whole thing. Well, there's a story in the Bible that actually has a similar scenario to that. As you know, we're talking about breakthrough. And today's topic is breakthrough through faith, not feelings. Because sometimes we can get into a situation where our feelings will want to take over. But in order to see breakthrough, you have to have faith. You have to have confidence in what God has already said and promised. So the stories in Joshua chapter 6, it's where the Israelites are up against um, the city of Jericho. God says, I've already given you the city. I've given you the mighty men in, J in Ch Joshua chapter 6 verse 2. And the Israelites go up and they see the city. And the city, actually, um, archaeologists have excavated, and they said it's about 48 feet tall. It actually has two tiers, and the highest one's 48. It has got rock and mud and thick, so there was really no way in. And God said, this city is yours, but there was a barrier between them and the city. So the Israelites had an option. Either they're going to choose to trust God's word, or allow their feelings of doubt and insecurity to make them um, not believe God, to doubt. And if you know the story, God said, march around the city six times, and on the seventh day, march around seven times, and at the last one, shout and blow horns and it'll fall over. Amazingly, they did it. They trusted God and they did it, and the walls came down and they took the city. So I think the message for us is that sometimes we, you know, well, God has actually, for all of us, God has given us promises in His Word. And sometimes what keeps us from believing it is our feelings. We don't, we're doubting, we don't trust it. And really, if we want to see His promises happen, if we want to trust His Word, we need to start trusting Him in faith. We need to believe it. And that's how breakthrough happens, is you have faith to see it through. So, the I think the message for us today is what are your feelings dictating your beliefs or is your confidence in God and his promise dictating your beliefs? So I'd like to see us move forward and trusting God, not based on our feelings because they change. Depends on the situation. Maybe this, this situation looks really tough and hard, but God says, I'm with you. And God says, I've called you and I've chosen you. So choose to trust his word, have faith in his word, not in your feelings. And we're praying that you see breakthrough in areas of your life. Until next time, good to see you.